completing the McDonald's gap verification or gap check procedure. First of all, we need to change the grill into the gap check mode. So we've changed the button, we have gap check. Now we can press the green button to start the procedure. When it comes down, we're going to take the green side of the tool and we're going to check the four points. So we'll start at the back, the green tool goes under, start at the front left, green tool goes under, the right left, no, the right front, the tool goes under, and the rear right tool goes under. Next, we're gonna try the no-go, so this is the red end. This shouldn't go under, however, on an MWE3S, we know in the inside rear edge of the outside plans, it will go under. So you can see it goes under. At the front, it doesn't go under. And then when we come to the other side, doesn't go under and doesn't go under. This is the expected result when using a Garland Slim Grill.